Newly released video and 911 calls of a harrowing ordeal on board a school bus. A man with a knife allegedly hijacking the vehicle packed with children, leading police in Arkansas on a 20 minute chase last month. Kids and driver safely rescued. ABC's Gio Benitez has a story. Watch the dramatic newly released video captured on police dash cam. Kids escaping a school bus, allegedly hijacked by a knife wielding man. Just minutes earlier, a frantic woman had dialed 911. And he got on the school bus with the knife with the bus driver, and they're driving down North Martin Street. Police chase that bus with 11 elementary school children on board. The driver describing the terror inside. He flipped the knife out and he said, drive, shut the door and drive. And that's what I did. I said, okay, okay, where do you want to go? What's wrong? The 911 caller on the street tries to keep calm. Um, I'm so scared. It, it's okay, just calm down, okay? He was some crazy freaking guy and he had a knife. He didn't even want me to stop the bus. He wanted me to switch with him while the bus was rolling. And I said, no, we can't do that. Police in Jacksonville, Arkansas chased the bus for some 12 miles until they stopped it. Those little kids run out one by one, rushing to safety. Give me a hand. Give me a hand. Little girl told me she was scared, and I told her it was going to be okay. Police surround the bus and arrest 22 year old Nicholas Miller. Law enforcement telling ABC News overnight Miller told them he took the bus because he felt somebody was after him. He's pleaded not guilty to 22 charges, including kidnapping. This morning, that bus driver of 20 years hailed as a hero. She certainly is. Nicholas Miller's father, by the way, told us his son is a great kid who wasn't trying to hurt anyone, but he acknowledged that Miller is addicted to drugs. He'll face a judge in January. Robin, just imagine these kids were on their way to school. Yeah, that's right. Think quick acting. All right, Gio, thanks very much.